Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your applications that are crashing on your Amazon Fire TV. So I'm just on the home screen over here. I'm going to scroll on over to settings and then go on down. And then let's go to applications right here. Then go to where it says manage installed applications and select this. Now locate the application you're having a problem with. So let's scroll on down under this list until we get to an application. So let's go to the VLC player for this example, or let's go to Twitch and select this. Then what you want to do is force stop the application, press that, then you can go to clear cache. And the cache should be clear right here. Also, you could try going to clear data. However, when you go to clear data, you will have to sign back in with your email address and password with your account on that specific application. Then also try uninstalling the application and then getting it back on your device. So you can go to the home screen after uninstalling it and then go to find, go down, and then go to the app store and select this. Then on the top, we can go to app library. So let's go on down, go to app library. Then we can go over to not installed and your most recently deleted application should be on the top here, and you can easily install it back. I deleted TDS at one point. Then you can select it and reinstall it back to your TV. Now, another thing you have to be aware about is maybe there's an update for the application and is trying to download the update, and there's not enough space. So if you go back to Applications and you go to Manage Installed Application, make sure you have enough internal storage right here and delete a few applications so you have enough internal space. So I should be good. Otherwise, you might not be able to download that update. Now, another thing you can try is simply restarting your TV. So back under the settings menu here, we want to locate My Fire TV or on the Fire TV itself, go to device and software, and then simply go to restart. Or if everything is completely lost, we can go to reset to factory default and start our Fire TV like it was new. And then we can try installing the application after doing that. But simply try restarting first and you should be good to go. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on Your 6 Tech.